In this video, we will show you how to run Windows 7 from RAM. First of all, go to reboot.pro and from there download WinBuilder082. Next, open the file that you just downloaded. In the Download Center window, select the projects that you want to download. For the purpose of this tutorial, we will check the win7pe.winbuilder.net slash projects option. Now go to the drop-down menu available on the top left side of the window and select the complete option. Once you're done, click on the download button. Once the download has completed, you'll be redirected to the WinBuilder software. In the new window, go to the source tab available on the top. Next, change the target directory by clicking on the folder icon. For the purpose of this tutorial, we have already created a folder by the name of Win7. We'll browse for that folder and set it as a target directory. Now browse for the ISO file by clicking on the folder icon. This file image is used by the CD DVD burners to create boot disks. Once you're done setting the target directories, click on the play icon available at the top of the window. As a result, you'll be redirected to the processing scripts screen. Over here, you can monitor the progress of the process. Make sure that you wait until the sequence gets completed. Once the process completes, VMware will open on your computer. When the bootloader appears on your screen, select the Win7 PESE option before you hit the Enter key. As a result, Windows will start to load in VMware. Selecting the Win7 PESE option will take you to the desktop and you'll be able to run Windows 7.